What's going on guys and welcome back to Gran Turismo 6. Today I am doing a race car build. This is where I basically just get a pretty standard car such as this one and I build it up to as close as I can get to 550 pp, um, preferably exactly 550 pp like this one is. Um, and then I take it for a well, a, I take it for four laps around the uh, Silverstone International Circuit, and whichever one is the best lap is the one that goes into the leaderboard. So the rules are: the car has to be 550 pp or less. Um, it has to have racing suspension, racing hard suspension, racing hard tires, race brakes, and then that's basically it. So our first car is the Subaru BRZS. This is a pretty cool car. Um, has 550 pp now. Um, 448 brake horsepower, not too bad, but not great. But only weighs 1,138 kilograms, so it is quite light. There's also front engine rear wheel drive. So, yeah, let's see how it goes on the track. All right, so we are here with the Subaru PRZ, and we're going to be doing four laps of the Silverstone International Circuit. So the reason why I picked this circuit really was. It's a pretty short circuit, just taking over just over a minute um, with most cars, at, well, like around this PP limit, from what I tested. And um, yeah, it's just a pretty cool circuit. It's got decent straights, decent corners. So I thought it would be a good circuit to do this, uh, this series on. So the Subaru is a pretty good car. Like I said, not really very much power. Not as much as I would have hoped, really. I mean, I wasn't expecting a bunch of power from this car. It does only start off with 197 horsepower. Um, now has 448. Um, so, you know, I wasn't expecting a lot. I was actually um, wondering if this thing would get to 550pp because um, it starts out at only 407pp. Um, so, you know, you've kind of got to you've got a fully upgraded, this is pretty much fully upgraded um, but it has, I've had to um, put a bit more weight onto it, you know, using the ballast um, just to get it back down to 550 because I think it went to like 559 or something um, so I had to just put it down, 556, something like that so I had to put it down um, but yeah, it is here now, oh we've gone very wide we have gone very wide into that. That is not fantastic. Oh god. Okay, this lap hasn't started off fantastically, I will say. Um, this car doesn't seem too bad to drive. A little bit of understeer, which I'm a bit surprised about. Um, it's like we're actually about even with our ghost, to be honest. Must have made up a bit of time through those other corners. Um, yeah, a little bit of understeer. Um, not as nice to drive as I would have hoped. But it's not, it's not bad. It does drive fairly nicely. Um, around here it's not too bad. Um, we are actually in front of our ghost, which I'm surprised about. I thought we would have been a bit behind him. But, you know, that's good. It's good that we're in front. Can we get around here without hitting the curb? Yes, we can. We're now fairly decent, way in front of him. What are we going to do for our first proper lap, 1 minute 9.6, not bad, but saying that, I don't know, you know, up against other cars, is that good? I do not know, I honestly do not know, um, yeah, so, not a bad car this, not too bad at all, um, one could, oh, bit of, the turning's a bit weird, um, get, you get bits of understeer, you also get bits of oversteer, at some points which isn't fantastic but you know it's not bad this car does look really cool though um, even in the in interior I oh, know it's pretty cool even though it's quite quite bland I suppose but it's quite cool of an, an interior um, I don't know why oh we've gone very wide we've gone very uh, we just really stuffed that lap up we were in the lead and now we're not okay it's gonna be down to the final lap to, uh, to get a better time, see if we can get a better time. If we can get better through that last corner, we should be able to, because we had it better, but we lost it on the last little bit. Alright, let's see how we go. That was just 275 millisecond slower than our best, which isn't 
bad, I suppose. Uh, but let's see how much better we can get. We are quite a bit ahead of our ghost at the moment. I think on my best I did run wide through there. So at the moment, so far so good. I'm a little bit slower through there that time, but we should be able to get around here pretty good. Oh yeah, we got a very good launch out of that corner. We are leaving our ghost behind. Goodbye, past. Subaru BRZ, we do not want you anymore. We're gonna go flying up straight. What speeds are we getting to before we break? About 144. Alright, that's not bad. That is not bad. Let's try and keep on the inside here, not go wide. Very good through that corner. We should be up for a pretty decent lap this time. Alright, let's break here. Maybe a little bit late on the braking, but um, I did manage to, you know, slam it down a bit more and then out of this corner, not as smooth as I would have liked through there. But we got it round, and we are going to come round, finish the lap with a 1 minute 9.197. Not bad. Um, don't know how that is up against future cars, obviously, because I haven't done them yet. But not bad at all, I do not think. So there we go. That is the Subaru BRZ race car build. If you enjoyed, please go ahead, like, and subscribe. Go ahead and comment what other cars you want to see me do a race car build off, remember they have to be able to get to at least somewhere very close to 550pp, don't really want any less than 530 really, um, and yeah, tell me what cars you want me to do, I'll see you guys in the next video.